When Tesla's president of heavy trucking, Jerome Gwilin, revealed that Tesla was working on a giant machine to make cars in the same way Matchbox die-cast cars are made, he wasn't kidding. The truly enormous gigapress is undoubtedly Tesla's secret weapon that will allow the company to cast Tesla vehicles like the Model Y rear chassis and crash rails as a single component. The 8,000-ton machine will also be called into action for the company's famous Cybertruck. So today, let's check out the gigapress the largest die-cast machines in the world. In 2020, Elon Musk revealed that Tesla had purchased two giant die-casting machines from Italian manufacturer IDRA. These machines would be used to die-cast the chassis and crash rails of the Tesla Model Y. Both machines are regarded as the largest high-pressure die-casting machines in the world. They exert a clamping force of 55,000 to 61,000 kilonewtons and weigh around 430 tons, but they weren't exactly what Musk had in mind. The machines were, of course, a formidable development that was met with a lot of excitement in the electric car community. Finally, here was a machine that could churn out cars not by having components manufactured individually, but through the system of die casting. The monster machines are as big as a house and can produce single cast pieces of Tesla's vehicles. In February of 2021, Musk had a die casting machine installed at his Giga Shanghai factory and two in the Tesla factory in California. One machine was installed in Berlin and another was taken to Giga Austin, where foundations were being laid for an even larger Gigapress machine. The new Gigapress will produce 1 million vehicles in a year. While the Tesla die-casting machines made by IDRA were gigantic, apparently they weren't the largest the company has ever made. IDRA general manager Ricardo Ferrario has now revealed that the mother of all die-casting machines has been made by special request from Musk. This Gigapress is the 8,000-ton machine whose main purpose will be to manufacture the Cybertruck. With complete deployment of the Gigapress, Tesla has its eye on producing up to a million electric vehicles in a year, including the Cybertruck. It requires 24 flatbed trucks to transport it. The new Gigapress is a monster of a machine that lives up to its reputation. It measures 64 feet by 19 feet by 17 feet and weighs 430 tons, which is roughly the equivalent of five space shuttles. The machine is so massive that it requires 24 flatbed trucks to transport its components. Musk placed the order for the machine back in March of 2021, and soon he will be receiving the delivery. When the earlier two IDRA Gigapress machines were being constructed at Tesla's factory in Fremont, California, they were so large they wouldn't even fit in in size. The company had to build additional structures to house the machines on short notice. As of today, Tesla has ordered 12 more Gigapress machines from IDRA. While these could be placed in various Gigafactories, where the 8,000-ton machine will be constructed has not yet been revealed. Many suspect it will be installed in Tesla's Terra Factory in Texas. What is the Gigapress? The Gigapress is an aluminium die-casting machine equipped with a variety of devices and systems that support the die-casting process. The machines are super efficient to the point of making a regular auto factory look like a toy maker. Each machine can produce around 45 complete castings per hour, which translates to around 1,000 castings a day. This means that one machine can produce 300,000 castings per year. When you take into account several of them working simultaneously, Tesla's target of a million vehicles doesn't seem so difficult to achieve. How does the Gigapress work? The Gigapress is the main die-casting mechanism that looks and functions like a regular die-casting machine, albeit on a larger scale. It uses two sets of ovens to handle the aluminium alloy. One melts metal using electricity and is heated to 850 degrees Celsius. The other oven stores the melted liquid metal. The Gigapress also uses a 4,000-litre vacuum tank and a quenching tank to reduce the casting temperature to a desirable limit. A mechanical trimming press and laser trim cuts off excess metal attaching to the casting. It also can contains a recycling system to reuse scrap metal. The excess metal is shredded and the offcuts are used for the next casting cycles. Basically, the entire cycle involves melting aluminium ingots and cutoffs from a previous casting cycle in an oven at 850 degrees Celsius temperature. Impurities are then removed and the liquid metal is conveyed into a second oven through heating pipes to maintain a temperature of 750 to 850 degrees Celsius. Before each cycle, the dye surfaces are lubricated by a robot spraying 35 
five milliliters of soybean oil in a thin layer to enable easier separation from the casting machine. Then, the casting system creates around 50 millibars of vacuum pressure inside the mold cavity. When the molten aluminium is sent from the storage oven to the shot chamber of the gigapress, the molten metal is forced inside the cavity by a high-speed plunger, which is also lubricated with 8 milliliters of oil before each shot. The molten metal is left inside until it solidifies, after which it's removed at 400 degrees centigrade. The raw cast is then placed into a quenching tank where the temperature is rapidly reduced to 50 degrees Celsius to sort out defects and increase any material properties. The open dye is then cooled to 185 degrees Celsius and cleaned by robots that prepare it for the next cycle that will start again after one or two minutes. The finished product. In the finishing stage, a mechanical trim press cuts each raw casting into various dimensions. The scrap aluminium is sent to a scrap metal shredder for recycling and returned back to the oven. The main casting is then checked by X-ray for internal defects and further perfected by a laser trimmer. It's also drilled by a CNC machine for fittings and checked for accuracy with a coordinate measuring machine. 2021 is the year of the Gigapress. Tesla 2021 is undoubtedly the year of their secret weapon, the Gigapress. With full deployment of the monster machine in all their Gigafactories, the target of a million vehicles may well be achieved. What's more, increased production combined with the new Tesla batteries will reduce the cost of its electric cars. The company is planning on a $25,000 Tesla, and let's not forget the final rollout of their much-awaited futuristic heavy-duty vehicle, the Cybertruck, is also in the works. That's all for this video. If you liked it, don't forget to click on the notification bell and subscribe to this channel. Thanks for watching.